Hey all you addicts out there, this is Jordan Kinnegy with Addicted Fishing. Today we're going to come at you with a tutorial on how to clean and how to fillet a trout. Here's a nice beautiful little rainbow trout we just got back from the lake this evening. <clears throat> I'm going to take this here Gerber knife and I'm going to show you guys how to fillet a perfectly nice little trout here. What we're going to do first, this is our six inch, six inch blade really works the best for these trout because it's smaller and you don't have quite as much to deal with. So we're going to take this and we're going to go right up the anus here. We're going to make one nice little slit all the way forward to that jawline. After making your incision, you're going to reach in here and you're going to cut the throat and actually remove those guts just like so. They'll fall right out of there. From here, I'm going to bring the belly towards me, making a nice incision from the top of the gill plate all the way down to its fin. And you cut that all the way through so that it's actually just a loose piece of meat hanging off from that belly piece. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find that spinal column, find that spine of the fish, and I'm going to, as soon as I touch it, I'm going to turn that blade parallel with the fish's spine. And you see how I made that nice little cut, it went about a half inch, and now it's holding right on the edge of the fish's spine. So we're going to take this knife and we're going to run it all the way down its spine, and we're going to go all the way down to the end of the tail. Nice sharp knife always makes it super easy, just like so. And there you have your first fillet. <clears throat> now what we're gonna do for the other side is just flip it over again, belly towards you. Make the same incision that you made before from the top of the gill plate down to the fin, just like so. Again, you have a nice loose piece of hanging meat. Same thing as before, we're gonna take that blade, find the spine, and lay it parallel with that spine holding that belly piece up and slowly cut all the way down this back through the tail and there we have it. So now the next step to this is we're going to remove these rib bones. What I like to use is either another knife blade or a fork of some sort so that you can hold on to the top of your fillet here. I'm going to stick that in right there and I'm going to take my knife and I'm going to again lay it parallel with these bones here. And what I'm going to do is I've pull this knife blade down towards the tail, I'm going to keep pulling my blade up into these bones so that it doesn't dig down into the meat and start taking away more meat that I'm going to want for dinner. So here we go, I'm going to start in right here, keeping that blade facing up, slowly pulling it down towards the tail, getting under, knife, under that flesh right there. I'm going to do one more swipe with it. Now we've come to the opposite sides fillet. What we're going to do is use that same method, put it, putting your knife or your fork right in the top of that fillet so that you have a good, good hold on it. And again, you're going to pull this blade towards you and towards the tail this time, and again, keeping that blade pointing up as it works its way through that rib cage, just like so. That one went a lot better than the last one. Same thing, remove that fin there, and we're ready to cook. There you have two beautiful trout fillets. We hope this tutorial helped you guys learn a little bit more about how to fillet fish and a trout especially. So be sure and go over here and, and hit this little subscribe button down here because we want everybody to be able to see these videos and we want you guys to see when we're coming out with some new ones. So be sure to like, be sure to share. We'll see you guys out there.